What's up y'all, good morning. I got a few packages came today. The first one from Vistaprint, I got uh, these melon stamps. So we can just put those right on the envelopes and speed up the process. And those business cards I showed you guys finally came. Well, I don't wanna say finally came because they came pretty quick. A few days and it was here. Let's see if I can focus that in. Give me some focus, there we go. So you can see came out pretty good I got a few things from Charmaine in the office I got her uh, her ink she's been talking to me about that for uh, a couple weeks now and I got some new printer paper so we're all set to go also here's the update as you can see we, we filled up that line we're on to the next line these are our snow plow customer remember our goal 200 right now we're about 50. We're about 50 customers because a lot of those customers has a lot of jobs. Maybe a little bit over 50, but uh, a weekend and we got to about 50 customers and it's only September. So uh, the goal to 200, I, I, I believe we'll be way past that. Uh, we'll probably get to about 300 this season, hopefully. Uh, today, I'm gonna show you guys a lot of the work that I do. Today should be about a $800 day. Hopefully around eight hundred, eight nine hundred dollar a day, uh, if everything goes to plan. I want to want you guys to see how much a solo entrepreneur can make. I have a few guys, but I'm trying to weed off having workers and switch to contractors. That's where my business is going, where I can contract all this work, and um, I think it'll go a lot smoother there. A lot of people, uh, it's hard finding workers nowadays. A lot of people um, own their business, so it's a lot easier for that to uh, get contractors in here and to do the work. And um, I got a lot of systems systems in place, so I, I'll show you guys more of that as we go. But uh, today, I gotta fix this line more. What's that? The negative wire came loose on uh, here. I don't know, uh, I gotta figure out where this goes. Cause right now, every place I put it on is uh, shocking a little bit. So I gotta figure out where this goes because I really need this line more today. I got a few hills I need to take care of. But uh, I'll take you guys with me today. I'm gonna show you a few yards. I'm gonna try and keep a tally of how much I'm making so you guys can see. Uh, I would say my companies, we're not on the higher end, but we're definitely not on the lower end. We're kind of mid-level on our prices. And uh, in this area, Cleveland, Ohio, you know a lot of people, it's not a... Uh, not the richest area. I'm not really in Cleveland. I'm kind of in the suburbs of Cleveland. I got a bunch in Cleveland though, but uh, we keep our prices kind of the mid-level type prices. I know in your area, you're probably making a lot more per yard than me, but uh, we, we're still, we, we go by um, quantity as far as our yards out this way. So um, I'll see you in the first yard. What's up, y'all? I'm starting late today, but I'm at the first property. It's uh, it's around nine o'clock. It's uh, the drive time property. I'm about to knock this out. I'm gonna get all the commercial lots done. Um, just cause I'm running late and I wanna make sure they're all done. It's just right here, this section right here, and it's another section over there. It's some more sections in the back over here. But I'm not going to do those today. I'm just going to focus on these front sections. And uh, I'll see you on the next one. Just knocked out that one right there. Just knocked that one out. Took about uh, three minutes. It's a little quick one. On to the next one. That's how you make your money, them little fast, little quick hits. What's up, y'all? I'm back at the warehouse. My weed whacker went down, so I gotta repair it. See what's going on in the office. Oh, hi, it's Charmaine. Hi, Charmaine, what do you got going on? Well, I'm sending out some emails to get these snow plowing jobs started. Do we have any new guys signed up? Okay. Okay, well, I'm gonna get this fixed and head back out. Get some video of this next property. I love it. 
It's right here on the water. So we gotta take all of this down. Cut the grass. I'm gonna cut that out too. Pretty nice property right here on the water. At this front yard. We'll get back to you with the uh, finished picture. Check this out. Look at all this debris. Cleared that out. Cleared the driveway. Now I'm going to blow it in the grass, mulch it up. Only thing I got to bring is a uh, chainsaw to get this uh, get this down. A dead pine tree back here. This living over here. Yeah. I'll show you the finished project. Just want to tell you it's going on one o'clock. I'm at about maybe I want to say probably like six. 600 for the day I only started around like 9 9 30 so I started cutting and it's only 12 and we're about at uh, 600 that's not including my other guys out here but uh, just me as a solo about 600 so you can see how some good money in lawn care so I'm gonna keep keep you updated I'm going for about 800 then I'm gonna stop for the day so I'll probably stop around like three Probably stop around three today. So I'm gonna show you a few more yards. I, I've cut a bunch of yards. I, I haven't even numbered them, but they're they're all pretty small and, and real close together. So I'm gonna uh, show you a few more. Got those two done back to back. About to move on to the next one. It's around the time I get tired. Got a lot of yards done so far, but I'm gonna keep on pushing, see how many I can get done. Uh, I'm probably around like 800 bucks right now for the day. That's before all my expenses and all that, but uh, 800 is cool. A solo operator, somebody working out of their house. You'll be killing it right now. Um, more advice coming soon. It's probably, I gotta cut that area. Over there. See, it's another huge area over here. Gotta cut all that down. This lot. It's huge. Some areas over here. 
at that time. Gotta get that. It's a big lot over here. What's up, man? What's going on, man? He's not. Uh, over here. That's about it. What's up y'all? I'm down for the day. Feel like Charmaine's on lunch. I see the board. Any more customers? Look like she erased the board. I think she's making it smaller for everyone. She's making all the writing smaller. That's the only reason it's erased. Today was a very, very long day. Today was a long day, y'all. Uh, um, I would say, say I made around like eight, nine hundred today. I uh, ended up doing a couple commercial properties, but uh, it just got too hot. It's around two o'clock, and uh, we're going through a heat wave out here in Cleveland. Tomorrow is supposed to get uh, super hot again. And uh, it's been cool the rest of the day, so I'm not used to the heat again. But uh, I stopped working for the day. I got a lot done. Uh, today's one of my slow weeks. That's the only reason I stopped, because um, it's not too much I have to do this week that uh, put me behind. I did uh, pick up that new project you've seen. Uh, I was walking around. That's a, a drive time property. Uh, they want that whole inside cut, so um, that's, that's some big money. I got to price that out for them. They want to cut in uh, spray. So uh, I gotta go over there and get some prices on that. I gotta uh, call the guy and uh, get some prices. Uh, give me one minute. And then um, that's it. Basically the day was nice and smooth, just a little hot. Uh, I guess I'll see you guys tomorrow.